In this video, we're going to take a look at how to measure the hardness of rigid plastics. Now keep in mind, there are three different shore hardness scales to measure. There's the shore double zero hardness scale, which measures rubbers and gels, typically pretty soft materials. Then there's the shore A hardness scale, which measures plastic parts that are soft, not too soft, but not too hard, kind of in the middle. And then finally, there's the shore D hardness scale, which measures the hard rubbers, the hard plastics, the semi-rigid plastics, and the very strong durable stuff. This little boat right here is Benchy, and Benchy was 3D printed. We're gonna measure Benchy's hardness using this shore D durometer scale. And this scale is used by number one, turning it on, number two, zeroing it out, and then three, taking this little probe right here, which is really sharp, and pushing it down against the hard plastics. Now, keep in mind, this is Shore D, so this is for rigid plastics. You could use this Shore D on softer materials, but you're gonna have a different reading. So I'm gonna push that into the bottom of Benchy here. All right, so Benchy's hardness is about 30. So that's Shore D. Uh, ooh, that even left a little mark on Benchy on the bottom there. Let's take a look at, well, these are recognizable. Let's do that on the very bottom. Let's measure the hardness of that. You're looking at about 43 Shore D. Now this lens, it has been scratched, so I can show you this guy. Let's measure the hardness of this lens. I'm gonna push down on this side here. here we're about a 59. Oh, that's pretty easy to see there. See right there? I definitely left a, a scar behind, but that's okay, because we've already scratched this lens up. Let's measure this. Let's measure the hard plastic here. 53. So there you have it, folks. That's how to use a Shore D durometer in order to measure the hardness of rigid plastics.